Welcome back, Leos. I'm the Empress. I'm happy to be here with you guys today. Now, these are general reads. It's going to be for the month of February. And it's going to be what's coming towards you, what energy is coming towards you for the month of February, okay? So, let's get into it. These are general reads. They might not resonate with you. If it does not, don't fret. Check your moon and your rising signs. Your message may be there, okay? So, let's see what message is coming towards. What's, what's coming towards my Leos for February? What message is there for Leos? Okay. Let me get one more card. I feel like you guys are maybe getting tired or fed up with something. Okay. All right. So, a few of them dropped out. We got transformation. And we got partnerships and alliances. Okay. So, maybe there is some type of temporary ending to some type of partnership or friendship. So, maybe... You're waiting on somebody to make a decision or you're waiting to make your decision. Okay, so we got choose wisely. Definitely letting me know that there is most definitely something on your mind about a decision and sacrifice. Okay, this is when things are in the air. This is when there is most definitely like a waiting period. There's delay. So there's a delay on some type of decision. Okay. And you've been suffering in silence about how this is going to go or how you're going to move forward. But I feel like you're just waiting, waiting this out, waiting for it to make some type of decision or you're waiting for someone to make a decision. Okay. So, while you're waiting things out, let's see what's going on. Okay, let me see something here. What message is there for Leos, okay? Leos. Leos are waiting for a decision to be made. What's going on? What's going on with my Leos for February? know if you're having a falling out with somebody okay i got success okay so success is on the horizon all right so give me one, oh. you guys cards just keep like flipping out everywhere okay what is going on someone is denying something about a promise that they made okay so Give me one more card for Leos, please. One card. Because <laughs> goodness, Leos got a lot going on. Leo, Leo. February. Okay. We got letting go. All right. We got letting go. There's this something in the way, okay? Something is in the way, possibly, of something being successful. Oh, okay. Belonging, okay? So this is, okay, wow. All right, so we got rigid and belonging. All right, let's look these up. There it is, belonging. Okay, so this is a, a feeling of home and acceptance. Okay, so come and enter the house of night. For when you choose this symbol, you have joined us in this community of beauty, friendship, and secrets. Only shared and known amongst my chosen ones. So this is like a, being accepted into some type of group. This is some type of feelings of belonging. Something to do with stability and home life. Something is in the way, okay, with rigid here. Something is in the way, okay, of something being successful for you. And you may be deciding that you need to let something go. 
something needs to be let go of okay so let's let's get some clarifiers and see what's what okay at the bottom of the deck we have high priestess of earth you could be dealing with a virgo taurus or a capricorn we got meditation so something has been on your mind okay so you're, you're in meditative mode and or someone has something to think about okay so let's see what's what i want to see why belonging is here for you guys okay maybe that's the decision that you need to make on whether or not if you fit in if you belong in this circle of people okay you may feel um on edge when you're around a certain group of people you're trying to let that go and trying to find ways to make this experience successful is what i'm getting as well too okay so why is belonging here okay eight of wands we got justice libra gemini no this is libra's energy okay so there, there's communication here it's open communication so maybe you feel like you belong okay you've you've been communicating with a group of people okay why is the eight of wands here you feel like you fit in or you've been communicating with with uh pe with peers why is the eight of wands yeah uh-huh you feel like you belong okay you feel like you fit in okay you feel like you fit in with this certain group okay you feel like you, you fit in okay so why is rigid here rigid something is blocking it though something is in the way what is in the way why is rigid here magician nice magician here okay okay you there's something in the way okay but you're still trying to make this work there's something that is blocking something that's in the way but you're still trying to make this work okay you're still trying to make this work okay so we have letting go We got Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn's energy. You could be dealing with the Capricorn. But this is someone that is, you may feel like the pace of the situation is just too slow for you. Like, you know, you might be feeling like this person or this situation is, you know, you may feel like, you know, yeah, I fit in. You might get fit in in many different places, okay? You, you are Leo, so you're pretty much, you know, you can bend to plenty different situations. But I feel like you wanted something here, but the pace of it is just too slow. Okay, because we got nine of cups and the lovers. You could be dealing with a Gemini, but you may have wanted this person to love you. This person is dragging their feet, taking their slow time. So you may be like, you know what? I'm, I'm trying to make this work. I'm proving that I can fit in and do the part play my part but you may be moving too slow for me i want you know this love here i want a decision to be made why's the lovers card here yeah i want a decision to be made on how we're going to move forward you're going you possibly could be dealing with a cancer okay so success why is success here I'm picking up as well, too. You could be communicating with your friends, talking to your friends, and getting advice from your friends on how to 
break down this wall to make this situation work, you may be coming to the conclusion that you may need to let go of a situation or let go of a certain person because you know what it is exactly that you want. All right, so why is success here? All right, Ten of Wands. Okay, so you may feel like you, you have to let something go. The Ten of Wands is saying that, you know, something could be a burden. Okay, something could most definitely be a burden. I got Queen of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, Page of Wands. There's communication. So maybe you're communicating to someone that the situation is just too much. Why is the Ten of Wands here? Queen of Pentacles popped out again. Okay, so definitely Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. Oh, there's a... Oh, wow. Okay, so there's like this big blow up. We got the Tower and the Five of Wands. There's this big blow up, okay? You may be deciding to drop this situation. We got the Tower and the Five of Wands. This is most definitely a big blowout, okay? An argument, Okay. Someone could be coming off as cold, blunt. You may have to, you know, have to stand your ground and speak how you feel, speak your truth. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here? What does the Queen of Pentacles have to do with this? King of Swords, okay. Someone is lacking emotional stability with that Five of Pentacles. Someone that is like being really cold, okay. Someone's telling, speaking their truth to me. Yep, Page of Swords. Oh, there's some type of secret. Somebody's been doing some investigating. Y'all might have been doing some investigating. We got a definitely spying energy here. Moon and the Page of Swords. This is like a spy. Okay, so somebody's been get, gathering some information. You possibly have been gathering some information. And you may be deciding to drop this situation. Okay, you may be deciding to drop this situation, okay, because of some information that you have gotten or something that you've seen or heard. You guys may be dropping a situation, okay? All right, Knight of Cups, what is the challenge? Knight of Cups. Okay. Some type of invitation I'm picking up. Someone needs to close the chapter and start over. Yep, the world. All right, so somebody, you guys need to close a chapter, okay? Look, we got the Ten of Wands, letting something go and ending it, okay? You guys... <laughs> Need to close some chapters. Some a chapter needs to be closed. Okay, the chapter most definitely needs to be closed. There we go. The death card. Okay, so a chapter needs to be closed. Okay, someone keeps oh, someone keeps coming back and forth. Someone keeps running in and out of your life. Okay, you need to close that that chapter. That chapter needs to be closed. Okay, you need to end that cycle. That cycle is most definitely is what's holding you back. Okay. Five of Swords, okay? So you may feel defeated if you close this chapter. You may feel like, okay, well, this person got the best of me and you may just feel like, you know, Feel some type of way about it. What's the future energy? Or someone's jealous, okay? When we got you guys' energy, the sun card. But look, going ahead, you're going to be on a new journey, okay? You have to be willing to take this risk to close this chapter in order for you to come out on the other side with this sun positive energy, okay? So I feel like you're going to be deciding to close a chapter, okay? You're going to be deciding, why is the, I want to see why the Five of Swords is here. I'm not sure. I'm just picking up on, like, either there's some disagreements or an argument of some sort or there's some type of jealousy going on. Why is the Five? Okay, so the truth comes out. Someone's speaking their truth, okay? 
something, some type of truth is being revealed. Someone's asking somebody some questions. Maybe you're asking someone some questions, okay? But you're not surprised by the answer that you get. You're not even going to be surprised. Why is the sun card here? So I'm getting like everyone's asking you about it. Everyone, I feel like a lot of people are asking you, uh, you know, asking you questions about this situation. And I feel like you're not surprised about people asking, why is the sun card here? We got the moon. Interesting. Okay, so we got the sun and the moon. So something most definitely comes to the light. Some type of truth comes out. Okay, some type of truth comes out. And somebody is waiting for somebody. You are waiting for somebody to communicate with you. Okay, you've been holding this in and you've been waiting on somebody to communicate some type of truth. Some type of truth is getting ready to come out. Why is the Knight of Cups here? Emperor, Aries is energy, okay? Hmm. This could be someone older than you. Why is the Emperor here? Three of Swords. Ooh. I'm getting there could be three people. We got the King of Swords here as well. There's some type of pain or hurt. Why's the three of swords here? There we go again. King of swords. Somebody's real cold hearted. Somebody is real cold hearted. That's what I'm picking up. Okay. Somebody is cold hearted as hell. I want to know why this moon card is here. If this page of swords come out, there's most definitely some spying going on. And some truth is getting ready to be revealed. Okay. Six of swords. Your intuition is telling you, I feel like you're waking up from like this bad dream and your intuition is telling you, you know, six of swords, it's time for me to move on, time for me to go, let this go. There we go. Your intuition telling you to leave. Somebody, well, some of you are definitely dealing with the Capricorn. Look, this person is not in a good position okay this person does not have this their shit together okay this person is you know lacking a lot of things okay so if your intuition is telling you to close this chapter you might need to go ahead and close this chapter one thing about it leo is y'all are very passionate and loving and caring people and y'all love to spoil your person the people that you love but you have to always make sure that you're getting that same energy reciprocated to you if this person doesn't have nothing to offer you then you should not be you know giving um an arm and a leg okay that's the world card here i'm definitely sensing closures okay queen of cups pisces cancer scorpio Hierophant, Taurus. That's the Hierophant. Queen of Cups came right back out. Okay. Somebody's running back and forth to some. I'm definitely sensing someone's juggling here. You could be dealing with somebody that's juggling, or you could be doing a juggling. Some truth comes out about this, and your intuition is telling you to move on. Okay. All right, so that's going to be the message that I have for you, Leos. I hope it was helpful, all right? And until next time, my loves, don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe, all right? Until next time.